Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, where I talk about the latest and coolest developments in technology. Today, I have some exciting news to share with you. Google has just announced a groundbreaking AI model that can create video games from text, images, or even real-world photos. Yes, you heard that right. This AI can turn your sketches or snapshots into playable 2D worlds. How amazing is that? This AI model is called Genie, which stands for Generative Interactive Environment. It is a project by Google DeepMind, the same company that created AlphaGo, the AI that beat the world champion of Go and AlphaFold, the AI that solved a 50-year-old challenge in biology. Genie is the result of a collaboration between Google DeepMind and the University of British Columbia, and it was recently presented at the International Conference on Learning Representations, one of the most prestigious AI conferences in the world. So, how does Genie work? Well, Genie is trained on over 200,000 hours of 2D platformer gameplay videos, all publicly available on the internet. These videos teach the AI the fundamentals of 2D platforming design, such as how to create platforms, enemies, obstacles, power-ups, and goals. Genie can also differentiate the playable elements from the static backgrounds and interfaces, and it can generate realistic physics and animations for the characters and objects. But the most impressive feature of Genie is that it can create games from any kind of input, such as synthetic images, photographs, sketches, and even text descriptions. For example, you can draw a simple scene with a stick figure, a tree, and a cloud, and Genie will turn it into a game. Or, you can take a photo of your backyard, and Genie will transform it into a game where you can explore the environment and interact with the objects. Or, you can write a sentence like, a game where you are a ninja and you have to fight zombies, and Genie will generate a game that matches your description. Of course, these games are not perfect, and they are not meant to compete with the professional games made by human developers. They are more like prototypes or proofs of concept, and they have some limitations and glitches. For example, the graphics are blurry and pixelated, the motion is choppy and erratic, and there is not much variety or challenge in the gameplay. But remember, this is the first time we are seeing Genie, and it is still a work in progress. As the model trains and improves, its output will undoubtedly get better and more refined. So, why is Genie important, and what are the implications of this technology? Well, Genie is a remarkable example of generative AI, which is a branch of AI that focuses on creating new content from existing data. Generative AI has already shown amazing results in other domains, such as text, images, and video. For instance, you may have heard of GPT, the AI that can write anything from essays to code, or DALI, the AI that can create images from text prompts, or Sora, the AI that can generate video from text or images. Genie is the first AI that can create interactive content, such as video games, from any kind of input. This opens up new possibilities for creativity and entertainment, as well as education and research. For example, Imagine if you could use Genie to create your own custom games, based on your preferences and interests. You could draw your own characters and worlds, or use photos of your favorite places or people, or write your own stories and scenarios, and Genie would turn them into games that you can play and share with others. You could also use Genie to learn about game design, or to test different ideas and concepts, or to generate new content for existing games. Genie could also be used as a tool for studying human cognition and behavior, or for developing new AI agents and algorithms, or for exploring the potential and limits of generative AI. In conclusion, Genie is a groundbreaking AI model that can create video games from text, images, or even real-world photos. And it is the first AI that can generate interactive content. Genie is still in its early stages, and it has some limitations and flaws, but it also shows a lot of promise and potential. Genie is a fascinating example of how AI can revolutionize gaming and creativity, and how it can change the way we interact with digital environments. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And don't forget to leave a comment below and let me know what you think of Genie and what kind of games you would like to create with it. I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring. Thank you for watching this video.